Hello guys, I'm doing another video. Um, my previous three videos, if I remember properly, was my unturned greenlit review, green light, and my two videos about the medical injury system. I got an idea for uh, unturned two, as well. I was going to put some input on what I think about it. And why I think they get uh, on the get greenlit. First off, uh, when I reviewed it, I I'm being honest. I'm not going to take back what I said because I told I completely meant it. That I do not like the game at the moment due to the lack of content. Of course, it is a one-man development team, and I'm not expecting large updates daily or even weekly uh, at Best, I expect maybe a small update once a week. Um, as I have, I sort of know now a bit more on development. I had, I've never made my own game. I did get a Minecraft animator a while back, and I have been working on a single animation just for fun. I think I've worked on it a total of about two or three hours now just to get 60 seconds. And even that, that's just simple stuff. It's not even that good. Anyway, that's not the point. I can see that it takes a good amount of time to do stuff. So I'm not expecting large updates. One thing I do suggest to get unturned back to life, at least for me, and I'm guessing several other players... As me, as me and my friend, when Unturned uh, 1 came out, we played it for hours. We made uh, huge bases, and I mean, we tried to, actually. This was before um, base building was messed up. This was way back in Unturned 1. And then Unturned 2, we started working on some good bases. I made several that I don't know why they got wiped, but whatever. Um, it just got old. We, I mean, we even stopped talking about it. We used to talk about it every day. We used to, uh, put ideas in between each other, see what could improve the game. But we've ta stopped talking about it altogether. We haven't even been referencing it or anything, which is surprising considering how much we enjoyed Unturned. But I would suggest adding a, a nice update that would bring a lot of new content to the game. It doesn't have to be like, a whole new game or anything but to make it entertaining again just add different things I'm not saying add more guns or add new items I don't really have anything specific to add I've been out of ideas for unturned recently due to the fact that I've been busy uh, playing other games actually and when I do start playing unturned again which I plan on doing at some point uh, bring some ideas with me from other games. I definitely hope that medical system gets added, as that would be something unique to uh, Unturned. <coughs> but the uh, reason I don't think it got greenlit... <clears throat> I mean, for some reason nowadays, graphics are everything... The simplistic graphics could have definitely hurt it for a survival game. Let's compare it to other survival games. Let's compare it to uh, Infestation Survivor Stories, which, by the way, is a horrible game. I am surprised I'm comparing Unturned to it. I don't think Unturned is a very good game at the moment for the lack of content, which the developer can't do nothing about it. It's just him being a one-man team, after all. But... I can't believe I'm comparing it to Infestation. I just don't have a better example. Actually, Rust. I'll do that. Because Infestation sucks. I don't want to compare it to anything. It's, I think it's one of the worst games that have ever existed. Not true. I'm pretty sure I hate other games. But anyway, uh, Rust, it has very high def graphics from what I've been told. I've run it on the lowest graphics possible because it's bad on my computer. Mine's not a very powerful computer. I'm surprised I can run Rust at a very manageable FPS and Skyrim at a decent, playable, I must say. But Daisy, 
Um, the graphics are good on it. The, on Rust, it's the same way. There's grass. It's not like pixels. It's actual grass that sways in the wind. There's a much better graphics. I think at the best graphics, there's ray ca uh, not ray casting, shaders. That's why I'm thinking. I always say ray casting when I mean shaders. I think there's shaders at uh, the highest graphics. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, apparently people care for graphics a lot. Oh, of course, I don't think this is the sole reason it didn't get greenlit. I think it's a con contributor, yes, but, um, as Mazelle said, I do think it, oh, wait, Mazelle, I think, <laughs> I'm stupid, sorry. I think, uh, I can't remember who said, I think it was, I think he said himself, I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm getting mixed up. It's probably because there is uh there wasn't very high steam traffic. Um that would be reasonable. It did most of its traffic probably came from uh came not from steam. Actually I don't know I'm pretty sure that's what it is, I'm pretty sure. Anyway Um after Steam, after it gets Steam greenlit, greenlit, will I do another review? Probably after a few more updates, I probably would do another one. Um, just so you guys know, I actually voted yes for it again greenlit. I'll just so I'll let you guys know because I mean, my review wasn't very good, so I think people thought I wouldn't want it on Steam, which I definitely did. I mean, if there, if it's a free game, I don't really see who would be against it because it wouldn't hurt you to download it wouldn't cost anything which I have tried several free steam games and they have been horrible so to me the free steam games really lack a lot like I've had bad experiences early on of course I've already played unturned so this wouldn't carry over I'm mostly just talking about random things that have no relevance to my point which is seemingly what my videos have become, which I'm hoping that will change when Unturned is uh, back out and has more features in it. Um, actually, a quick idea would be to add fishing. Like maybe you can find scrap metal because I I have been out in the water. I have caught random crap out in the water. I think I've caught turtles, tires, empty cans. Um, I think I called fishing rod once, actually. It's kind of funny. Actually, I've called a lot of different crap before. But that'd be something um, just to have out, be able to go fishing, catch fish for food, and find other random crap. That would be, it wouldn't be a very high chance, but it'd be something. Actually, I just saw that that's also in Minecraft. You can find random crap while fishing. Even though that's not where I got the idea from. I was actually thinking from personal experience. If fishing is added, why not add randomly spawning uh, fishing rods at a very low chance and fishing lures and such on the beaches or on the coast or wherever you, you plan on putting the spawns at? Because I have gone fishing before when I did fish a lot. And I remember finding like uh, lures that got left behind or little uh, artificial baits. It was pretty neat to find them. I mean, it was good to see uh, what other kinds of baits or words. Because I, um, I mean, my granddad always took me fishing and we just used like a live bait or uh, he, he had the, this thing called doll flies. I don't actually know its real name. That might actually be why it's called. I'm not sure, but it's most of what we fished with. Live bait or those doll flies, and sometimes an artificial bait. Anyway, I plan on doing another video. I will also explain in the next video what I do when I record, and like what I do with the videos after I record, I mean. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video, which I'm going to make right after this.